My name is Crystal Curly again, and um, this is my second video, so bear with me. This is the first time I'm doing this with my camera, a uh, video camera this time. Um, I'm gonna, I'm going to tell you ten things about me I would like you to know. One, I'm a Game of Thrones fan. The Orville, also a big fan, hence the hat and the necklace. Well, I'm also a Star Trek fan, as well as Star Wars. I'm just a big sci-fi fantasy type of girl. Um, Two, my favorite book is is the two princesses of Bamar. Then my favorite colors are pink, purple, and blue. Because when you put all three of those colors together, you get something amazing, beautiful, majestic. I can't just pick one color out of the three. And I love both cats and dogs. Even though I favor more towards cats at times, but I love both of me. Because both of them have their advantages. Uh, my favorite character in Star Wars is R2-D2. The sassiest droid to ever. <laughs> Uh, to ever be a part of the Star Wars fandom, R2-D2 saved a lot of people's butts. And needs more credit for that. And being sassy. Love the sassiness in characters. And I'm fascinated by sword fights. Like swashbuckling adventures. At one point, I always wanted to learn how to sword fight. It just seemed fun and fair. It's just whoever has the best skill wins. And that's it. And it's fair. Unless you trick the opponent. My favorite movie is Casablanca. Humphrey Bogart. Bittersweet ending, but still one of the best films ever. But that could quickly change since these, since people are producing high quality films now. And my favorite song is also from that movie, As Time Goes By. You can't help but be romanced by that song. Entranced. And I'm the type of girl who loves butterflies and angels. It would be fascinating if angels did exist. And I hope they do. Because I hope that my sister's one. Well, it's a good thing. Good, th good thing to calm down people. And just imagine these angels fighting the final battle. Wouldn't that be amazing seeing angels and demons go at it final war? Come on. And one thing's for sure. I placed in the top ten in this um, MPBL in Chicago. In this one event in sport, in a sports category, where I was the only woman to place in the top ten, it was um to contemporary sports issues. I placed um I placed um ninth, and I won this crystal statue, and it was the it was back in 2015, and 
and that year started off rough, but but that trophy made it worthwhile because that was the year I lost my sister, and then that trophy made it completely worth it. I mean, you know what I mean. It just it filled a void for a while. And I think she was watching out for me. Those are the 10 facts about me. Hopefully later on I'll find out more about y'all. Thank you for getting...